Waka Flocka is doing an EDM album. Yes. Is that is that is that still happening? He's actually doing a rap. You know, he has a rap album and he has an EDM album that he's working on all at the same time. Okay. Have you heard the EDM album? Oh yeah, it's definitely dope. I've heard it. Which have you heard the rap album? Is that done yet? Oh, that that's my. I can't wait till it come out. I'm so excited for everyone to hear it. <laughs> he's collab with a lot of different people this time, and it's a whole different. You know when you're in music, you have to show growth. And I think this album shows a lot of his growth. Lyrically, um, coming, I mean, even even uh, personally, him coming from a man to a boy and him, I mean, from a boy to a man and even the things that he's gone through in his life, um, being able to share his emotions more um, with people. Um, I don't think a lot of people see that from Waka. Well, you, you know, a lot of people forget, I feel, how many hit records Waka got. Last time we talked, I think he was telling me how none of his singles have done less than gold. Yeah, his, his, um, yeah, his, 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 a lot of people don't know how many, he's, he's like, people can say what the hell they want. That man has hits. <laughs> and whether you have an opinion that he can rap or he can't rap, he has hits. He has, you know, he, he has a lot, he's done a lot in career that a lot of rappers haven't been even touched yet. Um, and his new album uh, is nothing less than, I mean, it's, it's definitely, it's definitely some hits up there too. So if not all of them, so I just, I can't wait till it drop. And even him doing EDM, a lot of, a lot of rappers can't even touch that type of market, but they love him and he's, he's, uh, it's, I mean, I'm proud of him. I'm so happy <laughs> for him. Well, is there a name for the hip hop album? Um, I don't know. I, don't, I think it's going to be um, Valley too. Just be looking forward for my clover line that's coming out. Well, it actually launched, but it's T. Rivera. You can find it on T-Rivera.com. Um, and I have a lot of other things that I'm working on, but I won't discuss those yet. <laughs> so tell me about the clothing line. Like, you know, a lot of people create clothing lines, but what's really your plan in terms of distribution and, and so forth? Well, I mean, like... And that's the difference between everybody. I've been doing this for a minute now. I've um, actually, it took, it's took it been years before I even came out with, with, even debuted it. I went back and forth so many times, like I take it very seriously. I use a lot of like knit and ponte um, mixed with leather, leather textiles. I have like a, um, it's a very, it's something I'm very passionate about. So I take it very serious. It's not like one of these lines where they're just doing like cheap dresses like three dollar yard material no no disrespect to anyone's line but i really take time and effort before i you know present something to the world make sure that it's 100 percent something that i will wear that represents me um so that's what t rivera is it's just you know and it, i make it for more girls who's kind of curvy slim thick the girls who are Slim but still, you know, thick. Cause I can't go into a place and I can't certain pants I can't buy because I'm I'm hippie. But I can wear the tops because I have a small waist. So these ones, you know, they'll fit everybody, but it still give you that high fashion approach. Now, what stores are you planning on putting this in? Or I'm going. I'm aiming high. Market? I'm trying to go to the bird offs. I'm trying to go to the you know the Neemans, and I want it everywhere eventually. Actually, that's why I'm here in New York right now. That's what I'm working on. <laughs>